What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed, I really recommend that you do. Cause like, why wouldn't you? So today, uh, what we're gonna do is recreate a look of one of my friends and she is very nice. We met over in the summer, I wanna believe, of last year, of last, blah, blah, 2020. 2020 is a whole blur, so I barely remember my own name to be real with you. But her name is Elizabeth Cambage. Okay, so let's go through Elizabeth Cambage and her little credentials. You feel me? And then I'll go through like the whole background of like how we met and then what I'm even doing in the first place. Liz plays basketball professionally in the WNBA and the WNBL and she's a beast, bro. When I tell you she's a tell you. Tell you she Bro, and she DJs, like come on bruh. Let's give you a little breakdown of what she does. She plays center, that's her position. She plays the five. She plays for the Las Vegas Aces. She plays over in Australia. She does the whole shebang. She does it all. Not only does she play basketball, she DJs like I said before. And she models. Bruh, that is so freaking dope. Back to her shindig so let me tell you a little bit about liz she was wnba peak performer 2018 all wnba first team all wnba second team wnba scoring leader uh wnba all rookie team three-time wnba all-star two-time wnbl champion wnbl uh mvp three-time wnbl all-star five Man, she does it all but what I love most about Liz is how humble she is and how funny she is as well. She does DJ, she's a freaking model, she's 6'8", she's a beast, like, and the stuff that we talk about is hilarious. Like, I swear to God, we're like this. You know like Spongebob and Squidward when they have like that connection with the heart thing? We're like brothers, only closer. I don't know if you remember, and it's kind of weird, but that's us. So we met over the summer uh, uh, while I was filming for Switch Cultures with my brother. She was super chill. Every time I would see her, I would make sure I'd say hi because I felt like I was the only female in the gym and I loved seeing other females there too because sometimes being in the male-dominated environment all the time gets kind of mellow. So seeing a girl, I'm like, oh, finally, like, let's go. And lo and behold, she is hella nice, hella sweet, and just a great overall person, and we just kept it ever since. So what I wanted to do in this video is recreate one of Liz's looks and see if I could look like my good old sis. I'ma put up the picture that I'ma do. Gaga, hey mama. Um, the reason I really chose this picture is because I already got the hair done. That's half the battle itself. You got the lazy. Do this look. So what I'm gonna start off with is priming my face because it's like I put Crisco all over my face. So I'm putting on my primer, my NYX pore filler. It looks kind of dirty. You're probably not gonna be able to see this. I hope you do. Um, and I'm gonna just go ahead and put that on my oily spot. So while I'm doing this, I kind of want to talk about, I don't know, I'm gonna just let it flow. I remember a lot of people would ask me, and even now, they would ask me, why don't you play basketball? You're so tall, do you play basketball? And I always tell them, no, I don't. I'd be like, I play volleyball. And then they'd be like, oh, I knew that. That was my second guess. I'm like, no the heck it wasn't. It was not your second guess. Don't even try to play me like that. Don't even try to to do me like that. I know you guys thought I play basketball. Makes sense, I am tall, I am black, I'm, I'm a girl, so that's usually where we go to. But no, Miss Man, I don't play basketball. I wish I could, but truly, I sucked. So what I'm gonna try to do right now is sculpt my eyebrows like hers. So let's see if we could do that. So 
So I just used my micro brow pencil by NYX. We're gonna go in with a concealer and clean that ish up because so far it don't look like my good sis Liz's. So what we need to do is clean it up. I think I need to make it a little bit skinnier. So I'm going to use my LA Girl Pro Concealer. I try to clean up all that. All right, my eyebrows look like sisters, not twins, but it's cool. So her face, it looks really flawless. Um, so I think I'm gonna try to cover up my dark spots with the concealer as well before I put on my foundation. I really love what Liz is doing within not only her profession, but like, her life doing what she wants to do and I think that's such goals like for real that's admirable especially for someone uh, that's an athlete like modeling come on that's so sick I always love seeing women in the sports industry athletics go into modeling and all these other different genres and different professions and expand who they are. It's admirable for um, to look up to people that are doing what they're great at and doing other things that they're great at as well, not just sticking to one thing. And I mean, I'm a fan. And I think more women, especially, um, should continue to do what they wanna do. Shouldn't limit themselves, period. That's why I love hearing about expansion within your industry, within other industries, and just doing more than one thing, so huge huge fan we're gonna do the foundation I am darker than Liz so of course I'm not gonna look you know like her twin I'm gonna look more like my good sis Monica Wright if you guys don't get that reference then I don't know what to tell you so I'm just getting my neck this might be my summer shade honestly because I feel like I just got so much darker. Oh man, I haven't been out in the sun for real, for real. So what I'm gonna do now is it looks like she highlighted her under eye, of course, her chin, her cheek, her over her lip, a little bit on her nose. All right. Oh, I have a bunch of funny basketball stories. Actually, when I tried to, to play basketball, I remember in middle school this was my basketball trying phase honestly i played basketball because in middle school i had to play three sports in order to get this award so i already did volleyball i was knew i was going to do track and then i was like f it bro i'm gonna just do basketball and then i ended up doing basketball i was buns i was so bad but I freaking was great on defense. When it came to offense, I was just like, take the ball, just just take the ball away from me because I don't want it. Like when everybody was like trying to defend me, trying to guard me, I was just like, bro, just take the ball and then I'll meet you on the other side of the court because I don't, I don't want to do that. So I'm blending this out with my beauty blender. Gotta get the five hit. I don't really know what this is, but I'm trying something new. Um, hmm. let me let me try to go through my thought process with what I just did here with my concealer. I'm trying to cover up more darker spots on my face so it can look more, you know, flawless. Um, but I also feel like I look like a fool, like I look like a clown. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to blend it because blending apparently does the trick for everything. Okay, so I have my concealer on and now we're going to try to do the contour, the cheek. I'm going to use my Fenty Truffle Matchstick. Don't do it. I'm recording. I knew it. Hi, uh, you too. Get out! <laughs> 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 
<laughs> well, at least your lighting's cool. What is that? Contour stick, you want some? Uh, what do you have the lines on your nose? <laughs> to make my nose look smaller. Really? Mm -hmm. And then the, the top of your head? To make my forehead look smaller. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. That's dope. Hey. Bye, you two! You're a jerk. That was my big head brother. I knew it. I, knew, I just had a feeling he was gonna come. Just had a feeling. I'm gonna buff it out and kind of bring it down. Okay. There's also this other story where I was in middle school. Um, we were at an away game and I had to shoot free throws and I hit the backboard. And in the back, somebody was like, Brack. and I was like, you're rude. So rude for no reason. Don't be yeah. rude. Are you kidding me? I stop. swear to God. Stop. Now I'm going with my can't stop, won't stop. <sighs> and go over my contour. Nice, now we're gonna go in with our powder, our translucent powder and Pat it in. Put on some blush. My blush looks like it might be a little darker than hers. So I'm gonna start off with a little bit of a lighter touch. I don't wanna go too overboard, but I really like it. I like the pink! All to the lids. I'm gonna go in with a light color. This will very, very light tan. Let's see. We're gonna put this on with our fluffy brush. My mom tried to make fun of my fluffy brush. And I'm gonna go over it with this like br more brownish tone. If you guys are saying, Ash, that looks the same. It looks like you're not putting anything onto your eyelid. Well, I promise you, it's there. Anyway, this is supposed to be looking very natural anyway, so. I don't want to hear no chitter chatter from you, especially the ones that haven't subscribed yet. You guys don't have a voice. I'm kidding. So, you know what? I'm going to put a little pink. I'm going to put a little pink right here. I'm going to get some highlighter because I feel like I'm not really getting that glow that I'm supposed to be getting. So. Girl whoever did Liz's makeup did a great job because this is a way harder than I thought. So her lips look pinkish. Oh god. I'm gonna put a little liner on. But I don't really have Okay, I'll be right back. I'm gonna put on my little falsies and we should be done. <sighs> that was way harder than I thought it would freaking be. My eyelashes really took me over the edge. They really did. But this is my final look of me trying to replicate Liz's look. Very natural, very, you know, soft glam. Got the middle part slick bun. Yeah, comment below if you guys think that I did a good job. So automatically comment below so you make me feel better. Make sure you subscribe, like, and share this video pretty, 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 pretty please because it definitely helps with growing our community. Yeah. There's no reason it should've took that long to freaking do this. But it was fun. I always like doing this for you guys because it's what do I do? Oh, I'm just really tired. I am so tired. All right, guys. I will see you guys on my next video. Woo woo. All right, I'm about to go to the gym and play some ball. And get this money. Just kidding. I'm about to take my makeup off. See you later. Bye.